Uh, the title is uh, Kefir Boy. Um, my belly is distended from malnutrition. From sifting through garbage dumps on victual expeditions I'm wishing. Mother creates miracles with vittles in the kitchen. Alexander's no type of suitable living condition. Square mouth ghetto, most deplorable scene, a despicable output of a ruthless apartheid machine. The dilapidated shack where I lay my head is a pittance of comfort where contempt is bred. The headline reads, you can be free on my newspaper sheet that I use to keep warm for lack of body heat. Thin cardboard separates flesh from earthen floor. Brother and sister huddle round the brazier by the door. Boldly, rats nibble at our extremities to see who has lost the battle against acute poverty. Papa waits before daybreak to perform Herculean tasks, his personal struggle beyond my comprehension, so I dare not ask. Sweet mother, heroine of this journey through misery, my shield, my sword, she watches over me constantly. I send earnest prayers to my ancestors regularly, from memory and tribal regalia as is customary. I face a stark reality that threatens to kill my essence, the best of what's left in me. Unemployment leaves us destitute, so we prostitute, turning our homes into houses of ill repute. Black policemen, debarked by moral weakness, blindly submit to white authority with eagerness. Pass laws, infanticide, segregation, police raids, bloody protests, no education, missionaries, gang violence, suicide attempts. If I ever get the chance to leave, I'm never coming back to this. Come on, wow. come on. I pray that I soon breathe the free air. Open my eyes and wake from this fiendish nightmare. Until then, I'm just a careful boy. Thanks.